What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here. Going to bring you a classic song. Uh, can't wait to show it to you. There's some really cool parts. None of it's too hard. Um, so we'll zoom in. I'm going to show you the chords, the rhythm, and all that good stuff. Also, uh, I really appreciate your support. Uh, I'd really appreciate if you subscribe to this new YouTube channel of mine. And uh, if you want to see other lessons or techniques, anything, go ahead and like this video, leave a comment. I really appreciate it. But let's zoom in and break this one down right now. Here we go. All right, so uh, there's like a part A verse and a part B verse, which they're the same chords and everything, but they're arranged a little differently. Then there's a section that I'll call, or we will together call the Amen section. And then there's a chorus and there's a bridge. So let's start with the very beginning of the song. And it goes like this. Here's one section of the A verse. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 So E minor to A minor. E minor to A minor. G to A minor, E minor to A minor. That's one section. And I was counting, um, I was counting groups of six. Uh, it was kind of the easiest way to subdivide how these chords are going. So it's always like four, two, four, two as far as the counts. So here's that A verse, section A verse, one more time. One, two, three, four, two. So you need an E minor, and you need an A minor, and you need a G. However you can play G. Later on in the song, we're going to need a D and a C chord, and there's a couple cool little uh, licks too. But anyway, here's the A section, but what happens is the A section repeats exactly again. So now we'll do that. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, minor, A minor, G, A minor, E, A minor. The whole thing starts over again. E minor, A minor, E minor, A minor, G, A minor, E minor, A minor. And now we have a new section. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. D to C. So here's the whole beginning of the song now. Starts over. A minor. Now we have what I'll call verse B, which is going to repeat through the song now. This is kind of the way the verse goes from here on out. It's the same thing, but it goes to that D and C section. So now we're at uh, the next part. into the amen section. So you can see nothing changed, but instead of repeating before it goes to the D to the C, it just does it one time through to the D to the, to the C. So we'll call that verse B. Here's that verse B again. E minor, A minor, E minor, A, G, A minor, E minor, A minor, D, 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 C, 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 stays on C. Holds out, so he says, A, 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 Into the chorus. So the Amen section is G. I like to play G with ring finger, middle finger, and pinky, because then it goes to the C real easily, like that. So, um, but if you can play it this way, that's fine. 
Now the first time it goes to a C major chord. But then the other times it's C minor instead of C major and you play it as a bar chord. You bar the third fret and then you play what looks like an A minor chord. So fourth fret, pinky on the fifth of the um, G, ring on the fifth of the D, like that. So check it out. Um, from the B verse, here we go. into the chorus. And I'm going like this on the low E string, three, two, two, one, three, two, two, one, three, two, two, one, E minor. So then we would learn what's called the chorus from this lick. And I'm gonna do it one more time from that verse. So now for the chorus, it's E minor, E minor, to B7, and that's a great chord. E minor and B7 have a great sound together, um, and the B7 is middle finger on the second fret of the A, first fret on the D, ring finger on the second fret of the G, open B, and pinky on the second fret of the high E. Great chord to have. So here's the chorus. Minor to B7. Then we're going to go to G. Then the G to A minor. A minor. E minor. And then a new lick, which the rhythm's the same, but the notes are different. Let's go back to the first part of the chorus. So the lick is five, three, three, two on the low E. E minor, then B7, and then G to A minor, G, A minor, E minor. Five, three, three, two. Now we're gonna do that B verse, and then repeat it again. So we've just done the chorus, and now we're back into the verse, and it's that B section verse, and we're gonna repeat it. Here it goes. <laughs> Did you notice I repeated what I said too? So here's the B verse two times. E minor, A, E, A minor, G, A minor, E minor, A minor, D, right into it again, E, e minor, the A, e, do, 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 do. A, G, A, E, A, D, C. And so now that we did that twice, it goes into the chorus again, but no lick, just straight into take me to E minor, then I play B7. Then I play G, A minor, E minor, with that other lick, 5, 3, 3, 2, E minor, 2, B, 7, then it's gonna go to G, G, A minor, E 
minor Now I'm at the bridge It's that section that happens one time in the song And it's some chords I'm about to teach you It's a C to a G A B7 G E minor C G B7 And then that takes us out to the end of the song. So what happened was we did the B verse twice and um, went into the chorus with no lick. And from the chorus, we did the bridge, which is C, G, B7, G, E minor, C, G, B7, G, E minor, C, G, B7, G, E minor, C, G, B7, and back to E minor. to the amen section. So here's that bridge. Now, vocally, it, and you know, in some ways, if you're playing this just by yourself with a guitar, the bridge may be better to just take that G out, which would sound like C, I mean the uh, second G. So C, G, B7, E minor, C, and just do it like that the whole time. But in the big wash of the recording with the ensemble, the bass is doing G, then E minor. But the rest of it's really washy. So here's that, so here's that bridge one more time. The, uh, the original way I showed you. Just remember that last part of the bridge, it finally goes to D and C for twice as long, or even three times as long. Build up into that amen. cool song. I really like this song and I hope uh, hope you were able to get it down. Also, thanks for subscribing to this YouTube channel. And if there's a song you'd like to learn or a technique you'd like to see me teach, go ahead and leave a comment below. I read them all and I really appreciate all your wonderful support. Thank you again and I can't wait to see you in another video. So see you later.